Yes. Okay. Today I would like to show you how to change the pin names from the generic IC. So therefore I take the generic IC out of this, out of the parts library, and I would like to um, to build this AT Tiny two three one three, and it has got twenty pins. So I change this here to twenty pins. And now I go to the schematic view, and here you can see that um, that are not the pin names, but only the pin numbers. So if I would like to change it, then I go to the Edit Pin Label button and start the Pin Label Editor. So here in the data sheet, I can see what are the pins named, and let's change some. So this is PA2. PD0, PD1, PA1, PA0, PA2. Is that right? Yes. What you you could even take the take other names if you would like to. So here is PD4, PD5, and this is the ground. And now, if I now press the tap button, it jumps over to the pin 11, where uh, where it goes on. So this is PB0, PB1, PB2, PB3, PB4, PB5, PB6, PB7, and VCC. Right, so now I can just save it, and as you can see, all the pin labels, label names changed. So this is um, how you can work with a generic IC2, and I hope this makes your life easier. So see you next time. Bye.